Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Alligator 6x6 Armored Personnel Carrier originated from BAE Systems as a development stemming from the SEP Tracked and Wheeled Modular Armored Vehicle Program, which commenced in 1994 to fulfill a requirement for the Swedish Army. Demonstrators were created in 2000, Tracked Version, and 2003, 6x6 Version, showcasing an innovative and advanced design. Despite the initial setback of the SEP being deemed too costly for Sweden and receiving no export orders, the program persisted, eventually leading to the introduction of the Alligator in 2010. The Alligator, often referred to by BAE Systems as an armored patrol vehicle, represents a streamlined and more cost-effective iteration of the SEP. While it may lack some of the groundbreaking features of its predecessor, such as a hybrid powertrain and variable suspension, it retains the modularity that characterized the SEP vehicles. One of the notable features of the Alligator is its ability to accommodate interchangeable mission modules, offering a high degree of versatility for various roles and tasks. In terms of protection, the Alligator boasts a robust hull constructed from welded steel armor, providing defense against small arms fire and artillery shell fragments. Additional armor can be applied in the field to enhance protection against heavier threats like heavy machine gun fire, and an active protection system is also likely available. With its V-shaped hull design, the Alligator is adept at mitigating the effects of landmines and odd explosions. The vehicle is equipped with an automatic suspension system, with optional NBC protection. Weaponry options for the Alligator include remotely controlled weapon stations featuring 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine guns, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. Various turret configurations are likely available, and the vehicle can also be adapted to carry anti-tank weapons or a 120mm mortar. In its APC configuration, the Alligator typically operates with a crew of two or three individuals and can transport up to eight fully equipped troops, who enter and exit the vehicle through rear doors. Unlike its hybrid diesel-electric predecessors, the Alligator operates on a conventional drivetrain, with a turbocharged diesel engine located at the front. While it lacks the pivot steering capability of the SEP, it can still be airlifted by the C-130 Hercules tactical transport aircraft. Thanks to its modular design, the Alligator can be swiftly reconfigured for various missions simply by swapping out mission modules, enabling roles such as command vehicle, armored ambulance, reconnaissance vehicle, recovery vehicle, mortar carrier, and potentially others. That's all for now. See you later.